people in Asia Pacific come together and they share their thoughts, uh, all their work and <coughs> all their groundwork to share together and um, share their best practice. Yeah, and then um, as most of the uh, plenary, they are focusing on law and policy, so let's make a change. Uh, my expectation from this conference is a uh, very challenge for my country because uh, in Kemi 2016, uh, we have a host country as well and celebrate. So we will carry on like as like in this conference service as we will do in 2016. I hope uh, we will we as uh, we as a Myanmar uh, got a lot of. Uh, opportunity for the women and and child and for the most of them are the youths. My expectations for the conference are to learn from all of the really so different everyone in, inside and everyone attending so to learn um, to share my experiences and um, what I know and what I don't know. I hope to learn um, I guess about youth programming from the youth fair and how we can face the challenges that young people are currently experiencing in accessing uh, sexual and reproductive health care. Uh, expectation this, uh, the advocacy of this organization will be implemented in different uh, areas, especially in the you know, provinces. There's a lot of uh, 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 indigenous people that needs our help. The, I would expect the youths to start sharing their ideas about what they have been done in their countries so that we can create a net network that is very strong so that we can share, it, share with each other um, the ideas and the uh, activities that we have done as well as to um, share what are their progresses so that we can move on together as a team, as a more connected team. Yeah, that would be my expectation. Oh, my expectation is basically to deepen my knowledge about the RH, uh, reproductive health, uh, women's advocacy and gender rights, uh, specifically in the relevance of the youth development because I'm a professor. Uh, so I mold the students, not just uh, in a basic academic, but also to open their minds for what's happening in the society. It's not about, you know, to, to protest so much about uh, for being anti-RH or what, but to be in the community and to help each other, you know, as a youth.